All right, all right. It's that time again, isn't it, for a little video update for you. I don't know what to say really in this one because uh, I literally have no idea of what is going on in the program. Uh, I'm being left in the complete dark and that's despite me being the so-called protagonist and all the atrocities that they claim on a day-to-day -day basis. In fact, every time I wake up in the afternoons after having gotten a few hours of sleep, I am supposedly guilty of this, that and the other without even knowing about it. Or I'm the main protagonist in all kinds of atrocities, be it real or be it in a, a virtual movie land. I don't know. I am completely removed from the actual situation despite being the so-called protagonist. And this is obviously per design because any time I get to be involved in any way, shape or form, the outcome is never how they intended and I always ruin uh, their propaganda uh, by uh, doing something that is uh, contrary to their interests and that's just me doing what I do and that's how fake and fabricated the propaganda of the program is it doesn't really have anything to do with it uh, with me personally I'm just the uh, I'm just a person who they use as a pretext and build all the propaganda around and of course they are taking elements and fragments of my life and putting in their propaganda campaigns and spinning it outrageously to create whatever narrative that they wish. And that's how propaganda and psyops work. And this is the persecution of me. It's predominantly psychological warfare. <clears throat> I don't get uh, assassinated physically, or, or at least uh, there has been a while since uh, any attempts have been made on me outright. And instead my character is being assassinated. My reputation is being completely and utterly uh, abolished, slandered, um, uh, and anything you can think of, I'm being accused of. Anything that you could <clears throat> accuse me of, uh, I have been accused of at some point in time. Of course, without there being any cases whatsoever, I said this over and over again, and and this is going to be continue to be a fact until the day that they uh, choose to uh, choose to put a end to this pro or conclusion to the program let's put it that way not an end there could be conclusions before there are ends but they're not even willing to put conclusions on this program that has been going on since 2008 and they are still heavily reliant on uh, on their ability to uh, to communicate to people through synthetic telepathy and they are still broadcasting to anybody and everybody who find themselves in my vicinity and of course it's all kinds of lunacy it's all kind of preposterous bullshit and it's just it's just a really really pathetic electronic harassment not just of me but also of people in my surroundings of course they're blaming me for it and it's uh, and it's and it's just so old and everybody knows what's going on uh, and yet any time that i uh, comment on something that is being communicated through these means to people people are, are not willing to really acknowledge it of course they're going to acknowledge it uh, through body language and sometimes with a comment and sometimes uh, give a little indirect uh, uh, verification of what is going on of course people do this all the time but there are also many people who who were not even who will not even acknowledge anything that is being communicated uh, if I say something but they will react to whatever communication that is being sent at the very same time. So we've got this uh, cognitive dissonance going on where people on one hand will acknowledge it and talk about the communications that the government and PET here in Denmark are perpetu perpetuating every single day, but they won't, they won't uh, do so unless it is allowed by the same people who are uh, in, in some cases electronic harassing the people who, who are not allowed to comment uh, on their own harassment. You see what I mean? Uh, by cognitive dissidents, it, it's, um, it's mind-boggling how people are, are willing to go along with the, uh, the out completely outrageous or technocratic authoritarianism that is going on. But this is what has been introduced over time and people have been normalized to all the things that are going on in the program and uh, people are, are being given an outlet and the outlet is to blame me for everything that is communicated through these means and all the virtual movie fabrication that I'm supposedly the protagonist in without having any involvement whatsoever that people are being trained in trained to 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 believe that this is me I'm responsible and everybody needs to hate me for it 
and and the government of course is designing their propaganda and psyops in such a way that these things uh, make it more let's ingestible uh, because of the way that the governments and their intelligence agencies are creating these very uh, psyops that I'm speaking about uh, in this video here so this is kind of what's going on uh, going on on a on an overall basis because I don't know any of the specifics of uh, any of the uh, of any of the other things that uh, are probably going on uh, as far as I know it.